Everybody, look, 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 everybody, so every, everybody's putting on their shirts. I wear my shirt all the time. It's, I, nice, it's nice to be an executive. I knew he was going to say that. Wait, wait, wait. Let me look like let me make you look like your average height. Okay, so here we go. The motor is coming out of the GTA. What happens, guys? Is we just keep getting more and more thorough. We, we've got. Whoa! Antifreeze. Extreme. Uh, you like that? Angle cam. Oh. Oh. And I don't even do yoga or anything. So, um, Joe and Carlos. Carlos, why don't you get some more rags because this is going to get really messy. This is kind of everywhere now. Clean up, clean up. Well, get, get, get the other ten percent so we don't so we don't like uh, start just tracking antifreeze everywhere. Um, key things on this: when you take these motors off, we've done it numerous times. You make sure the shifting linkage is off. If you forget the shifting linkage, you're going to feel it tugging on you. Yeah, the trans is already out. You, you make you make sure. There's Ooh. the trans. Go, Joe! <laughs> he does it a different way, but that's how he does it. He pulled the, he pulled the trans out first. Look at MustangMedic.com. We take the frustration out of restoration. Back with Joe, Bobby, and of course, Carlos. Yeah. 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 Boom. So, notice that's ground, ground cable's been disconnected. Don't forget that. It's a little thing. Wiring harness. Wiring harness. Wiring harness. Extreme angle. Oh, there it is. There's, an, there's a view of the motor about to come out. And we're going to get to see all the parts that weren't cleaned up now that we're taking the motor out. Because that's what happens when you buy a car and then you find out what you got. But not a Mustang Medic. You're going to see it all perfect and pretty as she goes out. So take it away, guys. I'm going to turn the camera around and here comes the engine. 289 coming out of a GTA 67. Just a little. Okay, okay. Pull that pan towards it a little bit, Bobby. Yep. I got it, I got it, I got it. Here. Don't, don't move it too much. Oh. Wait a minute. Let it drain a little bit more. Let it, let it dribble more. It needs to dribble. It's still dribbling. Mm -hmm. Not me. I'm done dribbling. Sometimes. <laughs> Hold that down, will you, Bobby? Because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to shoot the camera. Okay. There it is. Here's a view of the first view of the flex plate. Nice. There you go. There you go, Bobby. That's the way to let it loose. This, this is reminding me of the videos that we did in uh, SEMA. Remember the bathroom video? Oh, jeez. Well, it would be if much, I, I'd be holding yeah. something much smaller. If I can, if, oh, I, if I can, if I can find that bathroom video, I'll, sh I'll, I'll link it to this video for you guys. Which Engine one? mounts look okay. The one with the soap or the other one? Engine mounts look okay. They did paint the block blue, but the compression is uh, anemic. I'm not happy about it. Anemic this stuff, we, a, this uh, stuff, see this, guys? Painted like this so it looks good from the outside in the shade. We paint them all the way through and make them beautiful. Which, called. now that the motor's out, that's what's going to happen. It's going into full detail. Yay, yay, yay. But uh, there it is. All right, and they're backing, backing the motor out. And there it is, William. Your uh, 289 has been plucked from the GTA. There's you like that like terminology? There is your C4 that's been plucked and will be, of course, cleaned. And uh, she's leaking all over the place. So it's pretty obvious that we're going to be doing a... a fresh converter. Yeah, it's a fresh converter. So we got a fresh converter, which is good news. Thank you, Joe. But we are going to definitely look into uh, in the guts of this uh, trans to see if it's a rebuild. If it's not, we are rebuilding it, which actually we planned on doing already because we're assuming it's not rebuilt. But we'll see. And there is the condenser for the air conditioning, and there is the engine compartment. That's a new master. Good news. It's a looks like the uh, original or, or an original power steering pump. We got rust on this uh, body uh, chassis um, oh, not mount, chassis mount. So we're gonna pull all this off and clean all this out, and we're gonna clean it all all pretty. So uh, there it is. The engine has been removed from the GTA. Where'd it go? 
Dun, dun, dun. Oh, good work, Carlos. Good work. That's gonna go in an engine stand. Carlos knows what to do. What he's doing. Engine stand that thing. Tag it. Tag it and bag it. Tag and bag. We know the compression on it, so we're taking the heads off, and we got to do an inspection on a 289. You've seen it before. You'll see it again because we are thorough over here at Mustang Medic. Yes, we are. Now I'm not gonna just cut the video because you're, I'm sure you're gonna say something clever like you always do. Oh, see, you put me on the spot. Now my brain doesn't. Work. <laughs> no, you just you just gave me that one in a platter, and I'm holding back. Oh, Mustang medic. Oh, no, 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 no. We take the frustration out of. All right, here we go. Yeah. So it's a it's a tough job, but somebody's got to do it.